Erie County is now being accused of failing to protect its own employees. The allegations are being made by the woman accusing former Erie County Social Services Commissioner Al Dershberger of rape. Two on your side's Kelly Dudzik joins us now with more. Kelly? Aunt Mary Alice Dershberger resigned in December and in January pleaded not guilty to rape and a criminal sex act charge in an Albany County courtroom. Dershberger is accused of raping a woman he supervised when they were at an Albany hotel for a conference in December. A notice of claim filed by the woman's attorney accuses the county of knowing about sexual harassment and or abuse by Dershberger while he was employed by the county and allowing it to continue. A notice of claim is a precursor to a lawsuit. A spokesperson for the Erie County Executive told us that the county does not comment on claims when there's a pending lawsuit, but for the record, the county executive and his office, quote, are not aware of any prior claims of harassment or abuse alleged to have been committed by Dershberger. I asked attorney Paul Cambria, who is not involved in this case, what the chances are that this case goes to trial. Most of these cases are settled and it's one of these, we're not gonna admit anything, but the cost of litigation would be more than we're willing to give you and here it is. And, uh, you know, we'll settle it based on that. Cambria says if it does go to trial, it could take years waiting for a court to be available. After Dershberger's arraignment in Albany in January, his attorney said a portion of the defense strategy would be to show that the sexual contact between Dershberger and the woman was consensual. Kelly Dudzik, Channel 2 News.